Hiya. How are we all doing? Just wait and see if some people join. I'm um, coming on with no notice, so we'll probably not get anybody joining. We'll just get it up on my phone so that I can see any comments that I miss. Let's see if we get anybody to join. Hiya Jane, how are you? It's just you and me then, Jane. Not doing anything very exciting. Thank you, Jane. How's it going? How's the... Um... Let me move you down a bit. That's better. How's the wedding prep going? It's like we're on a date. Yeah, definitely. Just you and me, Jane. I think there's a couple more join now. I should have probably put a post up actually, but um, never mind. Yeah, I'm enjoying watching all your um, preparations on Instagram. Are you, you know those Mr and Mrs um, things you got from Aldi? Are you painting them like your table numbers? So, the big news is um, that I have been to weigh in. Yeah, painting them, good. Uh, I have been to weigh in and I have lost five pounds. So, you might remember that I only needed a pound for my... Um, I've got some people coming in now. I only needed a pound to get to Target and I lost five pounds. So I now weigh 11 stone, 10 pounds. 11 stone, 10 pounds. That's nearly as much as me. You weigh 12 stone. Oh, yeah. Hiya. Trudy says, I saw your Instagram. Well done. Hi, Francesca. Thanks to those joining, I've got a few people now. Um, I now weigh 11 stone at 10 pounds and my total weight loss is 14 stone 11 and a half pounds. Um, I'll probably have to say that again later. Um, so if I miss any comments asking how I got on, uh, let me know. Everyone's saying well done. Emma says so happy for you, Alfie will be so proud, of course he will. He's here, look. He's on his cushion. Well done, congratulations. Thank you for all the lovely comments. And may I say thank you again um, for to all the comment for all the comments on Alfie's vlog and on my daily vlogs. Um, and I know there's a few comments that I've, I've put the status up on Facebook and social media and I know there's a few comments on them, quite a few already. Um, but if I stopped to, if I didn't come on live until I'd caught up with all the comments, we'd probably be here till midnight. So, oh, you can't see. I wore the wrong top, really. I have got my Target badge. Sorry, the notifications are coming in thick and fast for my Instagram as well. So I've got my little Target badge. Let me go a bit closer. Here we go, can you see that? That's my Target badge. Oops, extreme close up there, sorry. People, thank you to all of you saying well done. Are you happy where you are now? You you've done well you look amazing thank you jane um yeah i'm pretty happy where i am i'm gonna see how where i am after the holiday 
um, the way, um, I'm the weighing lady at my group, but I've got another lady who weighs me. Um, so my weighing lady um, said, why don't I set my target at 11 stone 10? And I said, I want us to see how this holiday goes. And um, if, you, if you've watched me for a while, um, you'll know that sometimes when I get a big loss like this five pound, sometimes I see a little bit come back on the next day anyway, the next week anyway. And also I'm going from Thursday evening weighing and I'm now not weighing in until a week on Saturday and I'll be on holiday as well for five days. Um, so who knows what will happen next week, but at least I've got that big bracket um, and hopefully I'll, if I gain, I'll still at least be in target. But I mean, if I was to like uh, carry on losing or even despite adding healthy extras in or something, I probably would lower my target, but we'll see how we go. I mean, it has been it has been quite slow these past few weeks, the weight loss, so I'm not expecting a lot more to come off. Uh, so let me have a look. Delight Gladys says, delighted after your awful sad week, you certainly deserve it. Thank you. Katie says, so glad I caught this. You're a massive inspiration. After a dreadful week, you still managed to lose weight and smash it. Yeah, I'm really, really happy. And I know we have had a very sad week with losing Alfie. Um, but I applied the same the same um, thought process as I will do in a minute, Eleanor. I applied the same thought process um, as when we lost Andrew's nana. Um, eating over losing Alfie is not going to help the situation. And even though Alfie didn't understand, probably because he was a dog. Um, there is no way he would want me to eat over him sadly passing away um, and he wouldn't want me to go backwards and as someone else said is sitting up there on Rainbow Bridge looking down feeling very proud and actually another point that um, I made at group today is that and I think I've I said it in one of my vlogs maybe um, when I do go through a stressful or upsetting time I find solace and comfort in turning to the plan and having the plan um, be there for be there for me um, and to know what I'm doing and to have something else to concentrate on. Um, so yeah. Mimi says, how does Andrew feel? He's been getting a new wife every week for the last two years. Can't believe it. Can't, can't believe, believe it. it. Yeah, just, just can't. Yeah, he's just so proud of you, really. Yeah, it's amazing. I just never, never thought we'd get here. I mean, I don't think you did either, did you? No. So someone's asked to show us the certificate. So I've just shown you my certificate. Certificate. So I've just shown you my target badge. Here's my um, little target book which I haven't even looked at yet, but um, I'm going to look at that. What's, uh, what that also means is that I also got this 14 and a half stone award. So that's going in my kitchen. Then we got this target certificate. And then because I lost five pounds, can anybody can anybody guess um, what else I got? Slice of cake. No. Mm. Slim of the week. Yes, well done. So yeah, I got slim of the week as well, and I think that's the. Um, that's the first time for quite a while that I've had Slim of the Week. Um, so let's have a look at this, the stickers. 
so we've got um, over this side 14 and a half stone award um, target and slimmer of the week so I'll go through what I've got in my slimmer of the week basket shall I let me just see what um, if there's any more comments While I'm just looking through the comments, mm -hmm. does anybody want to try and guess what Andrew's bought me as my target present? Everyone's saying bless you and well done to Andrew. Yeah, I'm all right at all, really. Hello from Ireland, well done, so proud of you. Slim of the week. Sandy says, I'm so proud of you, Debbie. I think I've watched you from the beginning of your journey and you are truly amazing and a real inspiration. Thank you, Sandy. And I remember um, I remember you following me from the start. Incredible certificates. You have earned those amazing results. Again, many congratulations. Thank you, Denise. You got the hat trick. Catherine from Ireland says, how long did it take you? So it's it's just over two years. Um, over 110 weeks. This is my 110th week at Slimming World. Uh, I joined on the 7th of April 2016. And I think I need to do, I think I need to do like another introductory vlog um, to say who I am and what I've done because um, I've, I've got a hell of a lot of new follow, new subscribers lately. Flowers, chocolate, a cake, a ring, some lingerie, new rings, running shoes, clothes voucher, no, you're all really far, far, far from it. Are you ready? Are you ready? I think so. This is what Andrew bought me for my target. A new iPhone. Because if some of you may remember, I smashed the screen of my um, iPhone. Um, I don't know how long ago. Um, about... Six, eight months ago, is it? Oh, no, I don't think it's that long. Oh, yeah. um, and I've been surviving with this blooming Android phone that I can't get on with. Um, so um, I'm really, really happy. You couldn't have got something better. So, yeah, I'll open that later on. And I'll be able to, I'll be able to do lives again on my phone. Um, when obviously it'll take a bit of time to set up, but <clears throat> everyone's saying a nice present. So, do you want to see? Do you want to see what I got in the slim of the week basket? Congratulations! Loads of comments coming in. I just can't keep up with them. Have fun. You were a different woman in your first video. Can, oh yeah, are you watching? Can you go and put the get the first video up? Yeah, what on here? Yeah, do it on there. You might have to turn the brightness down. Oh, well, might do. Well, he's finding that. Let's have a look what I've got because I haven't really looked yet. Like, so I've got yeah. some fennel seeds. Any good? Any good recipes for fennel seeds? Let's have a look. Oh, I've got a. Be best roast chicken pasta mug shot which will have a sin value as it's a two percent fat one you hi Debs you did it you have been an amazing inspiration I have watched you from the beginning your face has changed this week thank you Lizzie so roast chicken pasta mug shot let's have a look what else we've got oh you can help me with this is this a um going to play with you know, just is this a grapefruit? <clears throat> yeah, it is a grapefruit. A white grapefruit. It's a big lemon. Let's have a look what else. A banana. Are you going to have a treat to celebrate Target? I've just been thinking. I don't think we've got much in the house. We've got some, um, some ice cream. But even that... Even the I've got two half tubs of um what's the ice cream called? That loose halo top. Yeah. I've got two half tubs. So even that would be within my sins because I've had one sin so far today. 
when and if you struggled on the way, uh, how did you keep motivated? I just kept looking at my awards, just kept thinking I am not going backwards. And having this channel and my other social media was a really big factor. Um, Elidia says she lost six pounds. You chatted before about BMI, so I'm guessing you're, no, I'm not, uh, well, I haven't updated it yet, uh, but I'm not, I'm, I'll still be in the overweight range, I think, even when I put in my new BMI. Right, so, Andrew's just interrupting this. Who wants to see my first ever vlog on YouTube? This was, um, let's have a look. Oh, it doesn't, t doesn't tell you the date. Oh, 13th of June, 2016. Thank you. Right, are you ready? My name is Can you hear that? Oh, hang on a second. My eyes are still wrong. And bear in mind that at this point I'd already lost two stone. Anyway. You can go back and watch that if you want to. It's in my Slimming World playlist. You started Slimming World on my birthday. What a difference, you look so different. Can't wait to keep watching you maintain. Thank you, Rachel. Anna says I inspired her to rejoin. Oops, hang on, sorry, I've just uh, lost my comments. I knew you could do it. Beyond proud of you. I'm going right back to the beginning to rewatch your videos. I'm three stone above that. I need that inspiration all over again. Still beautiful, just a bit rounder, but you look healthier. Thank you, Denise. I'm so happy that you got a target. Thank you, Rachel. Will you continue vlogging on your maintenance journey? Yes, I will. Um, as long as you want to watch, because it could get a bit boring. Me coming on and... and hi, Abby. Me coming on and... Um, reporting my weight loss every week. But has anybody noticed the name change? Um, so I've changed my channel name to Debbie's World and that is, um, the reason for that is um, because it's not just going to be about Slimming World and um, it's going to be just about my life and my Slimming World journey. Um, and I decided to do it. When I when I was uploading Alfie's vlog, I call it Alfie's vlog, uh, when I was uploading The Last Day, uh, which is Alfie's vlog, um, I just thought I needed to change the name um, because it wasn't purely relating to Slimming World. So I changed my um, channel name to Debbie's World. Um, and then the next day after that, um, I, I actually got a time hop to say that this day last year um, was when I changed it from Debbie SW to Debbie on Slimming World. So I thought that was a bit strange. Um, so going back to my uh, winnings from the Slimmer of the Week, I got an Alpen Light Bar, Cherry Bakewell flavour. Um, what else? Oh, I got another banana. Have a banana. And this is what I put in. So I got my own fruit back, what I put in. So I took, I think, four... Four easy peelers and a green pepper. So I've got all those back. 
How much have you lost in total? I think it is... <laughs> 14 stone, 11 and a half pounds in total. And also, going back to whether I'm going to have a treat tonight, if I'm going to be on here and then I'm going to be on Instagram Live, I might go on Instagram Live later. I'm not going to have time for eating. You know, this social media is very demanding. Oh. Tin of sweet corn. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's what I was going to say as well, I forgot. Will Andrew keep cooking and baking? The other reason I changed it to Debbie's World is because Andrew has got a Maltese tray bake recipe. Um, and it is, it would be, I, I have no idea how many sins would be in it, but it would be so high sin that literally Slimming World and Maltese Tray Bake can't be mentioned in the same sentence or the same video. So I thought if I'm going to um, film Andrew making that, then I can't really have Slimming World in my uh, YouTube title. So thumbs up if you'd like to see... Um, if you'd like to see um, Andrew's Maltese tray bake. Anna wants a Christmas cake. We'll see how we go. We'll see how we go. <clears throat> I like the channel name change. Can't wait to see Andrew's Maltese tray bake. It is literally so high sin though that you can't even sniff it. So I do have to warn you. Even if when you if you it's, it's that high sin when you when you sniff it, your teeth fall out. <laughs> yeah. At Target, you can enjoy more in moderation and work to maintain tray bake all day long and a holiday vlog. Yes, I'll be vlogging on holiday, and this will make it easier because I'll be able to transfer. Um, transfer clips a lot easier as well so and hopefully have a little bit more storage as well so a tin of sweet corn can't remember andrew should bring a channel out called andrew's bakes yeah well he hasn't got the patience to film so what no just thinking about a channel doing my own channel you know well if you do your own channel you've got to do your own filming your own editing and your own uploading that's easy though, isn't it? That's the easy bit. Is it? Mm. We'll see about that, won't we? Yeah. Thank you, Sally. I could call it Andrew. Naughty but nice. <laughs> a very big... Thank you. They're bringing out a new Target programme. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, Anna. I, I know someone asked about healthy extras. Um, I'm not going to be doing that just yet because I'm on holiday next week. Um, so I'm just going to enjoy my holiday. I will be taking some of my prepared food and I will be staying fairly sensible, but there will be a couple of treats. Was everyone at your group so thrilled? Yeah, they were really, really happy. Um, so yeah, really, really happy. And then the, I, I nearly, well done again, super proud. Enjoy your holidays. Thank you, Kit. I've been watching Rachel from Bales 1986 SW. Well done, Rachel. Uh, yeah, you got to tag it as well. Um, Abby says Andrew could have his own playlist. He has got his own playlist. It's called Andrew's Recipes. Um, Michelle says, are you sticking it this way? Are you going to set another target? Not at this moment. The only time I'll, I'll actually reset my target was if I actually get there and then I'll reset it. But at the moment, I'm really happy where I am and I want to enjoy this holiday and see where it takes me. Did you get a target pick with your consultant? No, because this consultant I've only been with for about six weeks. But because I'm on holiday next week, um, and I'm not going to my usual Thursday group. Um, I will see my, I'm going to the Saturday group uh, and I'll see my old consultant um, on Saturday. So not this Saturday, next Saturday. So I'm hoping that we'll 
she won't be too busy to get a I'm sorry about the state of my hair um get a picture with my old consultant who did the majority of my journey it was me Debbie what's the end amount of clothing size that you've dropped it's uh, I've gone from bursting literally bursting, bursting. Out. it was size 40 on it 30, 32 to 34 yeah. to 14 top and bottom that's I think you had a parachute at one point didn't you yeah, yeah. Oh, you haven't got them on there, have you? Um, I can't... Sh I mean, you've all seen the pictures of me in that blooming blue top, so I don't need to show you again. Um, but that was a 32, that blue top. What iPhone is it? It's an iPhone 6. I might do an unboxing video if I get time. I might do that actually while the while the phone's still on its frame. Crushed chilies were also in my um, summer of the week basket. How far into your journey did you start to exercise? I started straight away. So at twenty six stone seven and a half, I started with short walks. Because uh, she had little legs, in it. Short walks with Alfie. Um, five minutes and then slowly, slowly it uh, got longer and faster um, and then eventually I did, then I started um, YouTube videos uh, when I felt uh, probably about the, after about, after a few months, see you later Tracy, after a few months I did Bye, YouTube Trace. videos um, and then I got the Move It Lose It program um, at the gym um, and then I've just gone from strength to strength so yeah if I can exercise with walking at 26 stone 7 then anybody can I'm right thirsty now S Rose Allen what's your, what's your first name I made your crustless quiche and hummus today they were delicious oh I'm really glad you enjoyed them Congratulations. Thanks. See you later, Tracy. Thank you. Sophia. Mirai. Mirai says, made your couscous with mango today. Oh, did you enjoy it, Mirai? I really enjoyed it. What else have we got in this slim of the week basket? Chopped tomatoes. And I think there's just two more easy peelers. Oh, a pair, a pair, how much did I lose today or how much did, how much do you mean how much did I lose, I lost five pounds, an apple, and an easy peeler, so that was what was in the slimmer of the week basket, so lots of fruit and nice things, Anna got slimmer of the week, how much did you lose then Anna? So I've lost five pounds. So shall we, now there's a few more people here. Do you want me to go through the results again? And the certificates. Anna lost eight and a half. Well done, Anna. So I have been to group today. Uh, apologies if you've already heard this. I've been to group today and I've lost five pounds. So I now weigh 11 stone 10 pounds and I've got a total weight loss of 14 stone 11 and a half pounds. So that means that I hit target. My target is 12 stone. So I'm actually a pound under target at the moment. I've got my little uh, target badge. Uh, where's my little stickers gone? And I've got my target, target certificate. 
Then I got my 14 and a half stone award and I got summer of the week. So a nice quartet of awards, a uh, trio of awards should I say. And I got my little target booklet that I need to have a read through. There are 14 pounds in a, your four pounds. No, I mean, I'm a pound under my, with, with Slimming World, you get a six pound target range. So the lowest I could go is 14, 11. Um, but I'm, for, I'm 14, 11. Basically, hang on, let me explain it. No, I was explaining no, it. I just said the number's wrong. No, I'm just saying it's three pound either side of your target. That's yeah. It, yeah. Three pound either side of your target that you can be in and not pay. So currently I weigh um, eleven stone ten, and to get back in target, I would need to put a pound on, which probably won't be a problem with having a holiday next week. I'm certainly not going to worry about it anyway. And if I do have to pay for group next week, then that is fine. Uh, if I'm still under, um, and then my stickies, my my 14 and a half stone award, my target sticky and my um, slim of the week sticky. Anna says, what does Andrew, what's Andrew's thoughts on your journey to target? Unbelievable, isn't it? Can't believe it, Anna. Um... I thought, to be honest with you, I thought when she started, she'd probably lose, I don't know, three, four stone at oh, best. Yeah. Um, and then probably eventually put it back on again, because that's what normally happens. Mm. Um, but yeah, just, but after a few months of starting Slimming World, because she'd never done Slimming World before, mm. I could tell that it was, it was different from all the rest of the diets. Yeah. And you were more into it and more yeah. focused, weren't you? Yeah. 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 Mm. Angela lost six and a half. Well done, Angela. Thank you to those saying well done. Mary says, will you stick to the Slimming World meal routine you have now for maintenance? Yeah, I'll basically be sticking to plan. Uh, but I might add in healthy ex extra, el extra healthy extras. Um, and there'll be the odd meal out and things like that. Uh, but mainly I'll be sticking to plan. If you lose any more weight and you go below, will you pay again? Um, well, eventually I'll probably lower my target. Um, but I'm not expecting to lose a lot more weight now because, as I say, this... You don't need to, do you? No, this, um, this, this target has actually taken quite a while. Uh, it's been playing around with me for a bit, so... You know, I'm perfectly happy and yeah, I might still be um, overweight in the BMI scale, um, but I'm really happy with what I've done. Um, will I increase my sins? I'll probably look, look at increasing healthy extras first. I am five foot six, Kathleen. What would you say was the point you knew this time was your time? Um, well, probably when I, when I started the YouTube channel and when I got to my Club 10, uh, which was, for me, it was over three stone for my Club 10. Um, so I think, and that was, when I got to my Club 10 and I'd lost over three stone, that was when I told my family and friends and things. So I think that was the first time I started believing that I was going to lose some weight but I still didn't believe that I'd get as far as I have done um, when I got to under 20 stone I set my target at 15 and I thought I'd be really lucky to get to 15 stone so to get to, to, get to 12 stone um, is just unbelievable um, don't stop your videos, I love them, I never do it myself. Yeah, I'm going to carry on, as long as people are watching, I'll carry on. Um, I'm not sure there'll be a, a weighing update every single week, but there'll certainly be recipes and vlogs 
um, as much as I can do with a full time job and my other commitments. Will you still get 15 sins or less now you're at goal? As far as I understand it, it's still 5 to 15 sins. But of course it's personal preference how you work the plan and how you work the plan at target is personal preference. Uh, don't forget I haven't read the target booklet yet, but um, I think it's all common sense actually. Um, but I'll very much be following um, sort of in Jane Day's foot footsteps. I'll be following the plan as much as I can. If I need to, I'll add in health extra healthy extras. Try and say that when you've when you've had a few, um, and um, if such if if a party or a meal out was to come up, then I would probably go. Or, or a birthday. Or a birthday. A birthday yeah. I, may, I may not be quite as strict as I would have been, but I'll, there's no way I am going anywhere near back where I've come from, so I'll be staying. On the Slimming World plan, yeah. And it, it's a way. It is a way of life now. It's it's become easy. It, it's become my, like I said, my comfort and my planning. Keep doing what you're doing and have a fab holiday. Well done. Thank you. I'm sure Jane will have a few tips. Yeah, I'm sure she will. She's been texting me anyway. Denise says, how do you stop that inner voice telling you to eat junk food? Um, well, I say nothing is banned on Slimming World. Um, people have different views on this. Um, but if you really, really want something, you will find a way to fit it into your plan. That's the first thing I'm going to say. The second thing I'm going to say is, I fill up on the on the three my three meals a day, um, and I don't deprive myself. I don't say, oh, I'm not having carbs today. I'm not having this. I'm not having that. Um, Helen mentioned this in her vlog. Um, this is not a diet. This is a way of life. Um, so. For most, for most meals, you can find a way to make them Slimming World friendly. Um, and you can really fill yourself up on those free and speed foods. Um, and you, you do have to ask yourself if you really are hungry. When you've got a craving, you have to ask yourself, are you really hungry? Um, and have a drink first. Then, then start going through the list of your foods. So the first thing to turn to would be speed foods. Um, so the first thing I the first thing I'd do when I get a craving is have a drink. The second thing I'd do is um, just bear with me a second. Hello. Oh hi Brian. Uh, just but hang on a second. Can you talk to me? Sorry, go on. Oh. Sorry about this. She's on the phone, as you can see. I'll, um, I don't think she'll be long. I don't, I'm not sure who it is, actually. <clears throat> yeah, so I'm really proud of uh, of Debbie. I can't, you know, it's, just, it's unbelievable, isn't it? You can't, you can't get over what she's actually done. I mean, you see the pictures, don't you, and uh, comparisons and stuff. But it's like, it's really like living with a different person, really. It's not just what she looks like, but she's got so much more confidence, hasn't she? So, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> so. Hello, everybody. So a few of you want me to start a, a baking channel, dear. So it's just the problem. The problem is, is that it's just fitting it in time-wise. Yes. Um, Maltese a tray bake. 
Yeah, it's, it's a good one, is that? It's uh, it's quite simple as well, but it's it's really nice. I, I did um, I did it for one of the carers at work, and uh, she uh, she loved it. It makes about forty pieces that are about that size. They're only small, but they're probably be about three hundred scenes in each one. But um, but yeah, they're really nice. I'll have to I'll have to show you that one day. Um, so yeah. Um, I think I've done what I've done so far on Debbie's because I do I've got the, the bread ones I've got cakes I've got Christmas cakes on there I think somewhere um, yeah uh, thanks for all your lovely compliments and not just to Debbie but to me as well So, <clears throat> I don't think it should be much longer anyway. I'm sure you're getting fed up listening to me, probably not. Um, what have we got here? Any plans? Well, um, not sure yet. We usually make it up as we go along. So, um, like you said, we're on holiday next week. We're looking forward to that. After the bad week we've had this week, it'd be nice to get away and just do something different. Ah, she's back. Sorry about that, guys. I should not think so, no. That was my fitness instructor. My instructor from Fitness Stretch, Brian. I've lost the comments now. I'm really behind. Well, just, they're all talking about me now. They're not bothered about so you. So I was talking about um, stopping eating, wasn't I? So the first thing I would do is eat, is drink water. The second thing I would do is look at my certificates and start visualising what it is I want to achieve this week or next week or whatever or what my goals are and start visualising. So if I'm craving some of Andrew's Maltese Atrebic, I'll think, this week, oh. I want my target. Mm. This week, I want my 14 and a half stone award. But don't tell them about that piece you took in it, though, will you? I had one little tiny edge piece. It was bloody massive. You're getting me in trouble now. Um, and then if I still feel hungry after that, then I go for the speed food, so I'll go for the carrot sticks, the strawberries, the blueberries. The f One Sunday afternoon, I got some frozen fruit out of the fridge to eat, out of the freezer, because I really fancied a lollipop, but I didn't want to use any sins at that point. So I got some frozen fruit out of the freezer um, and ate that with a bit of sweetness sprinkled on. Um, then... If that doesn't satisfy me, I'll go to the free foods, like a boiled egg, or whatever. Or, but I tend to, I tend to, so one of the tools I use is... Um, a rolling pin. Will you shut up? You're putting me off. I'm trying to talk properly. Come on, then. One of the tools that I use is, um, when I'm feeling hungry or that I want to snack, I'll think back to the meal that I've recently eaten and remind myself how filling that was and picture my stomach being full and, and satiated and I find that really helps me. So again, that's a kind of visualisation. So yeah, I hope those few tips have helped. Yeah, Rachel reached target too. I can't wait, wait to eat your quiche and hummus. I bet your group were a bit emotional. Well, the group's changed a bit recently because of Sue leaving, so my old consultant. So it wasn't quite as, 
as big a moment as it would have been perhaps if Sue had still been here, but it was still nice. Please keep doing what I eat in a day. Yeah, I will do as much as I can. Obviously, I'm working full time. Um, I've, I've got my other social media. I've got my exercise to keep up with. But I will do as much as I can, I promise. Everyone's saying hi to Andrew. Are you having a banana? No. Yeah. Maltese a tray bake. Now he's. Have you seen this? So, right, as well, what I want to ask you is even though I've come on and done this and you all know the results, would you like me to do a, a proper weigh in vlog? Um, what, oops. Um, would you like me to come back when I've had a bit of time to let it all sink in? Stop messing! I just knocked me banana against you. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go in a minute. <laughs> oh dear, what was I saying? Right, would you like to see a vlog? Yeah, but this, this will be saved. This will be saved. Would you like to see a vlog of my weighing results at the weekend when I've had a bit more time to think about it? Thank you, Paula. Yes, I do use visualisation techniques. I hope I've answered that question already. Lydia says I should be a consultant. Maybe in the fullness of time, we'll see. Is your birthday coming up? Yes, it's my, well, it's on the 15th of June. Um, so, um, I've booked the day off work because it's a Friday and I think me and Andrew are going to have a date day. Um, so I don't know whether to, um, to stay in and get Andrew to make me a cake or to go out for the day and have fish and chips. Not both, one or the other. Um, what would you go for? Would you go for a birthday cake or fish and chips? Did you call Sue? Uh, she's already, she was too quick for me. She commented on my Instagram. People saying yes, I still want a vlog. I will try and do another vlog then. He is naughty, he's very naughty. <coughs> fish and chips, go out, outing and fish and chips. Denise says cake, birthday cake, all the best people are born in June. I like, I like Kim's idea, fish and chips. Fish and chips. Well, this 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 live video will be saved, so you'll be able to watch it back. Um, but yeah, I will. I will. I think. I think there's a lot of things that I'd like to say, like a lot of people to thank and things like that. So, right, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to get off. Um, I'm probably going to come on Instagram in a, in five or ten minutes once I've been to the ladies. Um, I'll come live on Instagram, but um, I'm going to get off now, um, upload this video, and then I'll come onto Instagram live. So if any of you are still around in 10, 15 minutes, then you can come and catch me on Instagram. What? Everybody think you want a way the way you're swaying from side to side. <laughs> he knows me too well. Thank you so much for joining me. Andrew can film the cake. Well, I don't think I can have both, but maybe if I'm a lot more below target, I will. Yeah, so it, it will take a little while to upload, so it will it'll be maybe about 10, 15 minutes before I come on Instagram. But um, yeah, I'm going to come on Instagram, so I shall see you shortly. Thank you so much for joining me.